In today's video, I'm gonna show you the proper way to factory reset your Samsung phone. Let's get started. Hey everybody, welcome to Tech with Brett, where I help tech work for you. And today we are working with the Galaxy Note 8 and I want to factory reset my phone. So some of the reasons you may want to factory reset is if you're going to sell your phone, if you're gonna trade it back into your carrier, or maybe you're having some issues and you've been told by support to factory reset your phone, this is the proper way to do it. Uh, there are other ways if maybe the phone is locked with a pin code, but that might possibly lock you out. So this is the proper steps to do. Now, before you begin, make sure that all your information is backed up and I have tons of videos about how to do that how to back it up through smart switch on your computer how to back it up to an SD card or Samsung cloud so many different options but we have already done that so check out one of those videos first and then once you're sure everything has backed up come and follow these instructions so to factory reset, there's two ways we can do it one we can just go into Bixby and ask for the factory reset options factory reset So there it opened up the factory reset settings, but is how I am going to do that is if you go into the notification panel, you click the settings, and then we're gonna go down here and go to general management. And down here at the bottom, you will see reset. So factory reset is where it will completely erase everything and wipe everything off the phone. Um, if you're just looking to reset your phone and it's not working, hold down the volume down and the power button for 15 seconds and that will just reset your phone. But this setting is going to completely erase everything that I have on the phone and restore it to factory default settings. So here I am going to click on the factory data reset right here. And then in here, it is going to show you what it is going to erase from your phone. And then it will show you each account that you have linked to your phone. So I have a lot of accounts there. And here it also will show you that some of the apps will actually be installed once you reset the phone. So I have already backed up everything. I'm sure I'm ready to do this. So here I'm just going to select reset. I do need to type in my pin code or pattern. This way it can confirm that you are actually resetting it so it doesn't lock your phone out to the next person that tries to use your phone or it doesn't lock you out of your phone. So here I'm gonna use my pin code and you may need to sign into your Samsung account if you haven't done so and you may need to connect to Wi-Fi as well. So now I'm ready, I'm just going to select delete all. And now it is confirming that I am wanting to reset and I will type in my Samsung account password and now it is going to reset all that information. So there it's going to go through and perform its factory reset, and now it's rebooting back up to the main page. And there you go, that is how you factory reset the Galaxy Note 8 or other Samsung devices. If you guys have any further questions, please leave a comment below. And if this is your first time here, I'd love to have you subscribe so that you can be notified of my new and upcoming videos. Make sure you check out the playlist on the side so that you can learn how to transfer all your information back to the Galaxy Note 8 if you have it backed up. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you on the next one.